Oh boy. Let's get into it. Welcome to the Ruby Tuesday. My name is Ruben. I am reviewing a league of their own. Just the first episode for now. I'm still working my way through the series and it officially comes out on Friday. So you'll be able to watch it there on Amazon Prime, I believe, or Prime Video as they want us to call it now. Um, I know there's going to be some grumblings already for people going into this because I've heard, I've seen a lot of the comments where people have gone, the, the original movie is amazing. Why make a series about that? And I had my reservations as well because going into this, I thought, well, why did we need this? And then watching it, I totally understand what they're doing. We have that original story about women who are recruited to be these professional base baseball players when um, there's a war on and there's a lack of men, basically. And so women get a chance to show their skills as well. But it's set during a time when if you're African-American or just a different skin color, then it's um, hard for you to be, you know, get a job, never mind become a professional sports player. And definitely not if you're a woman. So there's all these things stacked up against you, which they explore a lot, which the film does as well. I don't know when's the last time you watched the film. It is good, but it has dated somewhat. However, if you watch this series, they're attacking a lot of things that are relevant still today, but relevant more in that time. So if you're rolling your eyes and you're going, hang on a minute, are they just being woke for the sake of work? No, these elements, these situations were, you know, at the point of time in that day were the thing that was happening then. Um, if you were gay, lesbian, by um, difference from the norm, that was not allowed at all. You know, the, you, you could get beaten up or even killed, especially if you were a different skin color. They explore all of that. But at the core premise is baseball and uh, their skill in that, at least within the first episode. And they really showcase whether, you know, who's got what skill, the tryouts, how they're going to get into it. The, the score and the music in it is relevant for the time of the day and really adds a nice frenetic pace, really adds this pace and tone that makes it fun. And it's a lot funnier than I was expecting it to be. I was surprised at the comedy here. There's this quirky kind of tone and dialogue that is with the League of Their Own. It's a bit slapstick, a bit tongue in cheek. That is all at the, the central premise of these characters. They're going to be given time as far as I can tell because already in that first episode, they're already giving time. There are a few protagonists where they're going to be showcasing more of, but they do give time to many of the characters, kind of giving them backstories, enough for us to care about and continuing to watch. Now, whether this progresses or whether it's slow or long, I'll have to find out when I do a full review. But for now, I'm really interested to see what they're going to do with this. I understand why they've done it and I think it could be really fun. So far, I'm in enjoying it so let me know your thoughts down below when you've seen it what did you think will you be binge watching this do you mind that they've done a, a, a not a remake but a, a series of that story or do you think nobody should touch you know uh, original ideas it's like someone saying to me if you're really into the league of their own like we're gonna make a series of back to the future that for me would be like sacrilege i'm like don't know no uh, however, I think this is pretty good. Thanks so much for watching. Let me know your thoughts down below. Here are another two movie reviews for you to watch. But most of all, until next time, remember, live long on Tuesday.